friends welcome back to a simply simple life today i am doing a small trader joe's haul with you guys so i think i'm gonna go ahead and add it with the previous one that i did just a few days ago so for this trip i wasn't actually wanting to get any pantry stuff it was just specifically for happy mail stuff so let me go ahead and show you the happy mail so as you guys know uh, with my channel, I do um, I do give out happy mails. I don't announce it to, let's just say, I don't say this is for Miss Mary. I don't do that. It's just that I message my, my friends because you guys are all my friends. And then I ask for your uh, mailing address. And then um, I do kind of gather things up to be able to, to give um, as a happy mail. And then a couple of these happy mails, there's actually four of them. One is a happy mail birthday <laughs> with one of my besties here. Oh, happy, um, happy, happy birthday, Miss Katie. So I'm gathering stuff up uh, for one for her and then three other ones. So I want to mail this off hopefully by tomorrow. And so I wanted to stop at Trader Joe's. So this one is one of the happy mail items because they do not have a Trader Joe's. So this one is the pinks and whites. Uh, shortbread cookies with yogurt coating and sprinkles. It is so good. It reminds me so much of the, is it the circus, animal circus cookies? But it's made out of um, yogurt, so it's a lot more healthier. So I got two boxes of that. And then the other Happy Mail is going to be, um, along with that one, I'm also going to add the Trader Joe's Cocoa uh, Baton Wafer Cookies. Oh my gosh, this is so good. The kids love this so much. So I got two of that one as well. And I am losing daylight, so. And then I got another one of this. So last haul, I showed you guys this uh, cookie butter, a spickleless uh, cookie butter spread. There was a couple of you guys that did not know what a cookie butter was. So cookie butter, so I opened up this one. It's almost like peanut butter. So it has the consistency of peanut butter. And this is so good because you can put this into anything. I use it for a macaron filling often. But if you have vanilla ice cream, you can just scoop this out and put it onto like vanilla ice cream. It tastes so good. Or if you're having a really bad day, you can just get a spoon and then just kind of eat it out of the jar. So good. It's Like I said, it has a consistency of uh, peanut butter, but sweeter. And, there's okay. no nuts. and then also I wanted to share with you guys, um, if you guys watch my vlog, my kitchen is a mess. So I'm trying to show, not show you guys the kitchen area. We are remodeling our whole downstairs. And um, I did not show this into my last haul, but look at this one. This one is a Monstera plant that I had actually gotten at Trader Joe's two weeks ago. So it's not from this, um, this visit, but I went ahead and repotted it. And it has actually grown a bit, um, even just within two weeks, two weeks time. Isn't that pretty? I have my other one right there that I did a video um, of you guys um, two weeks ago that I'm ready to upload. And that one has grown a lot as well. Okay. And so just wanted to show you guys that because you can really find um, good plants over at Trader Joe's. This one, they also have the orchids, but this one was gifted to Danielle for her birthday. I ended up getting a basil today. I try to get or look at plants every time I go to Trader Joe's. I'm going to also show you guys the one that I have on my kitchen bay window right now. Last um, Trader Joe's haul, I showed you guys three plants that I purchased. That one was the aloe, and it matches so well with my uh, Sensi aloe vera warmer because I do, I am a Sensi consultant, so that one is still available. Here is the fern, and then here is the other plant that I got. Not cool. And look, this one, this one was the one that was uh, sprouting, and then this one is uh, beginning to sprout as well. But both of them has gotten a, a bit bigger, and it's only been a week, so it's really good to uh, repot them into a bigger pot, so they actually uh, can can just grow really All fast. Right, so back to the the haul. So I did get this one. Um, this one is roasted tomato and parmesan, and as you guys can see, like there's condensation because when we got it someone just actually took out, uh, took it out of the freezer and put it onto the shelf so they freeze the breads or they freeze certain items and then they put it onto the shelf i did not realize this i thought i kind of uh heard about it before but just my first time actually really experiencing it and then of course mandarin orange chicken this is one of our favorites from trader joe's and then the 
family also likes these uh, rainbow gems of little potatoes. I like to um, put them into the oven with um, like olive oil and sprinkle some seasoning in there. Works really great. This is also another Happy Meal. I got two of these. The dark chocolate bar with caramel and sea salt. Really good. Hubby actually really likes this. So I'm going to add that onto the Happy Meal as well. And then also my eggs. I made some macarons, so I used up all the eggs, so I went ahead and bought more. And then hubby picks out his TV dinner, or I call him TV dinner, but his lunch uh, dinners, because he can easily put them into the microwave. I don't have to cook him lunch. Spinach and cheese stuffed shells. He got two of those. And then he got a new one. Oops, sorry. He got a new one. This is the Pollock Paneer, spinach and paneer cheese season with a bit of curry and chili hmm. and then I got more of the honey I used up all mine from the um, the Thai uh, peanut noodle salad that I made for Danielle's birthday and then Danielle um, loves to bake these ones the lemon shortbread uh, bar mix lemon bars they're actually really really good and then this is a new item this one is Trader Joe's patio potato chips this is mixed bag of sea salt and vinegar delicious uh, dill home style ketchup and smoke and sweet barbecue flavored potato chips for like a dollar 99 hubby had to get more of that frosted maple he was almost out he said so he really likes this one because he has to have a bit more um what do you call these um more of this cereal the frosted maple and brown sugar shredded uh, bite-sized wheat uh because he needs more fiber and then also we already ate the one that I bought the last batch of this one the sour cream corn puffs are $1.99 they're so 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 addicting all right so I do make my ubi ice cream but they had some of this so I said oh you know what hubby let's go ahead and um and get some and just kind of taste it because they were like two dollars I think purple yam flavored ice cream ube ice cream over at Trader Joe's oh this one is also a happy meal the matcha green tea I love this if you um if you mix your uh, milk and froth it first and then um, have a glass of uh, filled with ice and then um, halfway with regular milk and then the other half with the frothed uh, milk mixed with this uh, matcha green tea it is so good it's just better than actually um, getting it at Starbucks and then I had to get these um, lightly smoked sardines in olive oil, um, anchovy fillets in olive oil. Got that one. And then we also got some pepper jack cheese. I like to have this along with like the deli meats that I get and um, put them over eggs. Like I love to have um, over easy eggs and then have the cheese melt on top of that. And then those deli meats kind of warm them up in the pan. And that's a good uh, healthy breakfast to have. Of course, uh, Danica has to have her hold the cone. They did have another flavor there. They had vanilla, this one, and then also a new uh, flavor of chocolate chip. I've seen it before during Christmas time where they had a pepper, like a peppermint. That was really good as well. The girls love this one, which is the mango mini mochi. Got that one. And then this one. Uh, I purchased this a, a long time ago, but it's the low calorie lemonade, which is actually really, really popular. This is so good um, if you're having a party and you put this over ice and then add some gin or vodka and then you got yourself a nice summer uh, summer drink. Okay, and that's it friends. Uh, like I said, it's a very small haul because I, I truly just went in there for my Happy Mail stuff and then wanted to show you guys that keep a lookout on plants. There's always good finds of plants over at Trader Joe's. This one at Trader Joe's, I had purchased this one for $19.99, this size. So it's a pretty good size. As always, friends, mahalo, and thank you for stopping by with A Simply Simple Life.